you a fun memory. So today's video is going to be a prep with us for our baby shower. Today is September 16th as I'm filming this and our shower is on Saturday the 19th. So in a couple days, I'm 33 weeks and five days today and I'm just so ready for our baby shower. If you're new here, our baby shower is not going to be like your typical shower that you normally would see. It's going to be a Halloween themed baby shower. My due date for baby girl is the day before Halloween and Halloween is our favorite holiday, specifically my favorite holiday. So I figured why not do a Halloween themed baby shower for Aurora. I had a Nightmare Before a Christmas themed baby shower that our friends threw for us and it was like everything that I could have imagined. That's my favorite movie, hands down. So I figured why not do another Halloween themed baby shower. So I have to do a couple things. Like I said, it's in a few days, but I figured I should get on it and start doing it now. You guys know I'm supposed to be resting. I'm not supposed to be on my feet too much. So I want to like space out the workload. Benny is also going to help me too, but I figured I would go ahead and get some things started with the girls so we have to paint some pumpkins yeah i also have a little pumpkin like sensory activity that i want to do with them in this video i have to start putting up like a few decorations i might wait until benny gets home for that though because there's like some things that i want to hang like on the wall and stuff he should be back home soon he's actually at work right now because he is re-enlisting in the military for a couple more years so that's kind of exciting are you girls ready? Yeah. I'm yeah. Excited. Yeah. Hold time for the baby shower to start. Before we go ahead and pull out all of like the decorations and stuff, I figured I would give you guys a bump update. So I'm 33 weeks and five days, and here is the bump. I am feeling so big lately. Like I feel. I feel massive like I feel like this is typically how I look when I'm about to deliver in my pregnancies but I'm just I'm so big what are you guys doing what do you guys think about the belly um, it's, big. It, it's big I can't even see my feet anymore I have to like bend over to see my toes all right so we're in our homeschool room it's kind of chaotic I don't think I've showed you guys like the little things that we updated in our homeschool room but I kind of like tried my best to organize all of our stuff for Layla's curriculum this year and then I also hung this whiteboard recently and then we have our calendar and weather chart in here and then I don't know if you guys remember this rug but it used to be in the playroom so it's kind of stained if you look closely like there's slime stains all over it so I eventually want to switch out this rug but for now it's in here Aurora likes to come in here whenever I'm homeschooling Layla and she likes to like sit on the floor and play so I figured a rug would be a lot more comfortable for her so those are the little updates that I have in our homeschool room. It's looking a little bit crazy right now because I have been like shoving all of our baby shower stuff. So there's like decorations all right there. I even have like, this is for our shower. Um, this is like the paint that we're gonna use for pumpkins. And then like, I just have like random baby shower things all over in this room. So that's why it kind of looks crazy. How big? This guy's saying, hi, Mulan from <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, let's take out all of the baby shower stuff and put it on the rug so we can see what we have. So go ahead and take out the skeleton guy. Our uh, favorite skeleton. Take this one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I found a ghost. Yeah, a ghost. And then there's spider webs. There's more ghosts. Mm -hmm. All of these are for the tables. The pumpkin. Another pumpkin. <coughs> There's some ghost lights. Ooh. Be careful with this one because this is glass. Oh yeah. I got some like candies or something in here. Mm -hmm. There's some treats. Yeah. 
And then this whole bag is baby shower stuff. So here is all of the baby shower decorations laid out. I have like some prize things over there. We have to paint all of these white pumpkins today. And then there's just a few things. I also have to go into the garage because we have like my normal Halloween decorations and I wanna see what I can use from there. So here's pretty much what we're working with today. Just laid out everything that way I can kind of see like where I want things, what I have, all of that stuff. Oh, my trick or treating bag. I think this is like all of our regular Halloween decorations, but I'm not sure. Why? Yeah, we might be able to use those. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to use anything now that I'm looking at it. Because, mm, yeah, I don't know. Because for our baby shower, I'm not going with like the typical orange decorations. It's more of like black things with pastel pink, lavender, mint. So I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to use any of these things because the colors just don't really go with the baby shower. Daddy. Be careful, there's pumpkin carving kit stuff right here, so it's kind of sharp. I, I love arts and crafts now. It's my new favorite thing to do. <laughs> yeah. And there anything there anything else in here we could use? Yeah, I think that's pretty much everything. I've been wearing it. <laughs> that's for New Year's. Yeehaw! <laughs> Your sister wants to try it. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are funny. <laughs> so here is all of the pumpkins we're going to be painting. These are like the three biggest pumpkins that I have to work with. So I think I'm going to paint these ones myself. I'm not sure how well these are going to paint too. They're kind of like a styrofoam, so I feel like they should be good. And then I have like a whole pack. I think there might be like 12 pumpkins in here. So we have to paint those too. Oh, thank you, baby. That's all. That one's mine. Thank you. Can I have all of the paint? I need all of them. Wow. Because mommy needs them. So here are the colors that we're going to be painting the pumpkins. So there's this lavender color, kind of like mint, mint color, and then a baby pink. So those are like the main colors of the shower, along with some like black decor for Halloween. Each pumpkin is only going to be one color, okay? Mm -hmm. All of it is going to be one color, so we cannot mix the paint. Okay, so which color do you want to do, Rory? They love purple? Yes. Since it's your favorite. And then I'll work on this one. I love my pumpkin. You love your pumpkin? So beautiful. You guys are doing a good job. You're welcome. I'm done. This pumpkin. Some of them are still wet because I literally just finished um, painting them. I had the girls paint two. I painted this one while I painted that one. This color is not really the color I was going for. It's a little brighter than I expected. It was supposed to be more like of a muted kind of mint color, but it's fine. I'm not worried about it. It still looks really cute. I think they came out really good. The stem came off this one, but I think I can just like glue it back in and shove it in there. So I'm not really concerned about that one, but it's wet right now, so that's why I can't put it in there. 
But yeah, they came out so good. Thank you girls for your help. So the next thing I think I'm going to work on the prizes. So here are the bags to put the prizes in. And then here is the prize stuff. Mm -hmm. So these are some prizes. These are so cute. They smell really good. They're pumpkin bath bombs. Yeah. I will try to link as much as I can down below. I got a lot of this stuff off of Etsy and Amazon. Mm -hmm. And then there's I got some ghost there, candles for the prizes. And there's like three and then here's some more. You can definitely see them. They're in wraps. Mm -hmm. So wrapped here's up. the little, their little ghost candles. So it? there's candles for the prizes. There's pumpkin bath bombs. I have some like, it's like a, I think they're like this big. It's like a little pumpkin decor that you just put in your house. I have that barely coming in the mail tomorrow. So I'm gonna have to just add those into the prize bags tomorrow. I bought clear treat bags and then I plan on filling them with candy and then I plan on putting like a little bit of candy in here since it's Halloween. There's going to be treats and candy literally everywhere. These are so cute, huh? I don't even remember how many I bought. Let's see, there's one. I want to blow some balloons today. There's six. Oh, you're gonna blow up some balloons today? Um, no, that has to be done the night before because I don't want them to pop last. Remember last time, some of them started popping in the house. How cute are these? They're so cute. Look at Rory. They're cute, huh? Okay, so what you can do for me, Layla, yes. is you can start like opening them. Okay. Very carefully, stick your hand in it, open it all the way like this, mm -hmm. and then just put it here for me so I can start filling them, okay? They smell good? What's fragile? Oh, fragile baby. means they can break easily. Mm -hmm. They smell good, huh? Here you go, Spy Thank pins. you. Okay, so one pumpkin. Don't be careful with it. Can I put a candle in? Yeah, one candle. Mm -hmm. I want a pink candle now. Okay, you put it in the next one. Okay, Mom. Yeah. There you go. Put the ghost in there. It's a cousin. Look what they do. Okay. And a pumpkin. Who's ready to do something fun? Me! Yeah? I have this like sensory table. It's from Ikea. So the tops come off. Let's take, take the, the tops top off. off. Mm -hmm. I think we need oh, a vacuum. Take that out. Yeah, let's vacuum it, the inside of the... Yeah. The bins really quickly. Oh, a pool. Be careful. Don't put anything in it yet. Wait for mommy. Oh. Wait for mommy still. Don't it's put anything so in it. Right. Mommy has two extra pumpkin bath bombs. So one is gonna go in each of your bins and then you guys can play with their LOLs in the water. And then the okay. other ones can see the, the water color change yes. like how day color change. Okay. So mommy's gonna put one in your water and it's gonna fizz and make cool color. You want one? Yeah? All right. There's yours. Ooh, look at the pumpkin. It reminds me of a pumpkin. Don't put it in pumpkin. yet. Don't put it in yet. Um, Mommy wants to take a picture of you guys. Oh. Okay, ready? Ah. Uh. Set. Go. Put them in there. Whoa! The stem is on breaking. Jump in, LOL. Go, you can put your LOLs in there. Woo! Go ahead, Rory. Go ahead. Splash. Wow. It sounds so cool. Is that cool? Yes. It feels weird. It's like all bubbling in my hand and I'm cold. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. It's big. Wow, they're really fizzing. So while the girls are doing their little sensory activity, I'm going to be working on a game 
I'm sure all of you guys have seen this game if you've ever been to baby shower it's just you get one of these like big bottles you can get this from like party city Walmart pretty much anywhere they have like party supplies and then you just fill it up with candy and then you guests have to guess how many candies are in here and then usually they just win this as a prize the candy that I'm going to be using is candy corn I feel like you either love candy corn or you hate it like there is no in between I personally love candy corn hopefully I bought enough because I only have this bag so fingers crossed that I bought enough or else I'm gonna have to do a Target drive up order so I'm gonna just go ahead and fill these up <laughs> Okay, I just <laughs> realized something right now as I was filling up this baby bottle. I'm gonna have to take out these candy corns because they're not going to work. I just realized the name of the game is guess how many little pumpkins. The candy corns are not pumpkin shaped. Good thing though is that I do have um, pumpkin shaped candy corns but I believe I only bought like two packs. So I don't know if they're going to fit in this bottle. I'm gonna go grab the packs and fingers crossed it works. So I got my pumpkins. Fingers crossed these fill up <laughs> the huge baby bottle. Get up, get up, do it, break away. We're talking to each other. I know we feel the same. About the situation, like we're stuck inside a game. Time to get out of this circle. Yeah, we both carry a scar. I was thankfully able to fill up the entire bottle, and I still have a few left in here. Comment down below. I want to see if anybody can guess how many little pumpkins are in this baby bottle and I will send you guys a little Starbucks gift card if you can guess how many little pumpkins are in this baby bottle. So let me know in the comments down below and I'll send you guys a Starbucks gift card. So my next project is going to be hanging up these bats. I found this picture off of Pinterest, literally this entire shower, my inspo has been Pinterest. So this is the vibe that I'm going to go for. So I'm going to hang the bats like going around the mirror. Mommy's going to hang all the bats. Yeah. I'm going to hang them up like this. What do you think? Is that a yes or a no? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I wasn't sure. As you write the part we're playing, time to cherish who we are. The only thing I ever wanted starts with us taking the chance. Not like anything we've done before. Oh, oh, yeah. Now it's time for something better. And time for us to follow our dreams. No, we can't stay no more. Oh, come run away. Tell me so I got all of the bats up i think it turned out pretty good i think i should have went a little bit more like arched but i think it looks pretty good for the most part all i have to do is just adjust all the wings that way they're not so flat on the wall and they look more like 3d like they're flying because you can bend you can bend the wings like that the vlog here that's everything I'm gonna go ahead and get done today I feel like I got a good amount done but it's time for me to lay down and rest and get off my feet there's still a lot to be done but it's like last minute things like food prep and the balloon garland so that has to wait until like the night of 
like the day before the baby shower is when I'm gonna go ahead and do that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this baby shower prep with me. And if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the Moran family and make sure you hit that bell. That way you guys always get notified every single time we upload. The next video after this one will be our baby shower and I'm just so excited. But we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. Bye.